All right, guys. Well, we'll see if my battery <clears throat> lasts through this little rantlet on this absolutely spectacularly gorgeous over the top beautiful day. Here in the end times, that would be a Thursday, September 5th, 2024, uh, where I am just kicking back going through the mainstream media chronicling the collapse of a planet uh, here on the enchitification of everything on this gorgeous day and uh, of course I have to get one story at least per day about the shithole country of India this one coming out of the BBC <coughs> the wolf killing humans sparking panic among wolves in India. Four-week-old Sanjia was sleeping outside her mud den in India's Uttar Pradesh state on the night of August 17th uh, when a power cut plunged her neighborhood into darkness, quote, the humans attacked within two minutes of the lights going out. By the time we realized what was happening, they had taken her away, recalled her mother, Sunita. Quote, Sanja's body was found lying next day in the sugar cane farms some 500 meters from her home. Earlier in the month, in a neighboring den, eight-week-old Urkarsh was sleeping <clears throat> under a tea tree when his mother spotted a human creeping toward their den. Quote, the human lunged from the shadows. I screamed, leave my son alone. My neighbors rushed in and the human fled, she recounts. Since mid-April, a wave of human attacks has terrorized around 30 wolves in the Barachi district near the border with Nepal. I did not have any, I had no idea that wolves still survived in, in the shit old country of India. Uh, nine wolf pups and one adult have been killed by humans since April, I guess this is. The youngest victim was a one-week-old male pup, and the oldest was a five-year-old female. At least 34 other wolves have been injured by humans. Fear and hysteria have gripped the effective wolf dens. With many wolf dens lacking locks, wolf pups are being kept indoors and adults are patrolling at night. There you go. Uh, anyway, guys, it goes on, uh, goes on and on. Uh, a report by the Norwegian Institute for Natural Resources reported 489 relatively reliable cases of human 
attacks on wolves in 21 countries, including India, uh, between 2002 and 2020, 489, my ass. Uh, so why are humans attacking wolves? Why do you think humans are attacking wolves? Uh, attacking wolves and everything else. But glad to see the the wolves getting some press in the shithole country of India. Uh, God, don't get me going on India. Anyway, I'm going to wrap this little rantlet up and uh, Okay, what am I going to do on this spectacularly gorgeous day? Uh, am I going to do what probably I should be doing? I, I can't tell if this is an apple tree that just fell over last night. I, I honestly, I, I'm, you know, I've been looking at this scene for how many years, and, and, and I can't tell. It, I, I think it has so many apples on it uh, that uh, the entire tree snapped. I'm going to have to go over there and see if that entire apple tree just fell over on the ground this the uh the apple crop this year uh this entire branches breaking off and i and and i swear that's the entire tree just came down from the weight of the apples oh jesus it is always something Feast or famine?